Hello, everybody. It is wonderful to have all of you here. Uh, I want to make mention of uh, some folks in particular that uh, have helped us uh, to celebrate the arts and the humanities uh, for many years. Uh, first of all, if I'm not mistaken, our Democratic leader in the House of Representatives, Nancy Pelosi, a great champion of the arts, is here. Thank you, Nancy. The chairman of the National Endowment for the Arts, uh, Rocco Landisman, is here. Where's Rocco? There he is. The chairman of the National Endowment for the Humanities, Jim Leach, is here. The two most powerful people in the White House, uh, Jill Biden and Michelle Obama, are here. And two recipients uh, who were unable to be here, uh, but uh, who we love. Uh, I want to make sure to acknowledge Meryl Streep and Harper Lee could not be here today, but they will be receiving their awards as well. So please give them a round of applause. And that's why I'm so proud to have this opportunity to celebrate the contributions that all of you have made to our country. That's why we have to remember that our strength as a people runs deeper than our military might. It runs deeper than our GDP. It's also about our values and our ideals that each generation is called to uphold and that each artist helps us better understand. And it's also about the capacity of the arts and the humanities to connect us to one another. In a nation as, as big as ours, as diverse as ours, as full as debate and consternation as it sometimes is, uh, what the people we honor here today remind us of is that kernel of ourselves that connects to everyone else and allows us to get out of ourselves, to see through somebody else's eyes, to, to step in their shoes. And, and what more vital ingredient is there for our democracy than that? Now it is my privilege to present these medals uh, to our recipients in both the arts and the humanities. Accepting for Jacob's Pillow Dance Festival, Ella Boff. The 2010 National Medal of Arts to Jacobs Pillow Dance Festival for contributions to the development of dance in the United States as America's longest running international dance festival. Thousands of people of all ages from across the United States and the world have Jacobs Pillow to thank for opening their horizons to dance. 